Democrats are dancing in the streets while Republicans are just weeping in their beds. You see, it was announced today the unemployment rate has dropped below 8% to that magical number 7.8, which means Obama's probably going to get reelected because the economy is saved. Well, that may be true, but I do have some questions regarding all these jobs numbers. I mean, I just don't get it. There's three big numbers they always throw in our faces. Number one are the number of unemployment job claims that are filed each week. That's a weekly number that comes out every Friday. So you lose your job, go file for unemployment. That number every single week in 2012 has been 350,000 and above every single week, which you could say about a million and a half per month every month in, in 2012. Another important jobs number is the new jobs created. Now that number is given to us only monthly. Last month it was 114,000. And every month it's been about that, 100,000 plus, a little more, a little less. So correct me if I'm wrong, a million and a half jobs lost, 100,000 plus created. That's not reason to dance just yet in my book. Now, and by the way, the unemployment rate throughout this whole time of a million and a half lost, 100,000 gain, it goes down every month. I don't get it. Now, I realize smart economists are going to be saying, Bill, 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 you simple-minded fool. You just don't understand all that goes into the calculation of these numbers. You'd be right there. Let me make it even simpler. Here's the one answer I would love. Barack Obama is saying on the campaign trail, just about every speech, that under his presidency, over four million jobs have been created. I believe he's probably telling the truth on that. However, my question is, how many jobs have been lost under his presidency for then we'll get the net jobs gained or lost? That would tell us more about the economy than anything. Why is that number so hard? But nobody talks about that. Here's the formula. Four million jobs created minus X number of jobs lost equals the net jobs gained or lost. Oh, what a great number that would be. So, don't have an answer to my question, but I would like to end with a question this time. Actually, it's a psychological question. It's the way I sum this whole thing up. Let's say I have a bad case of cancer and the prognosis is not good. If, re if the Republicans and Democrats or just politicians come to me and they say, Bill, you're really healthy, don't worry about it, and I believe that, does that mean I will live long and prosper? I don't know, but that's what we're getting.